so here we are with the ace bean l17 i know it's dark can't really see that and then we're gonna go ahead head to head with the sofern if22a now this tree all the way in the back all the way in the back is about 400 feet away from where i'm standing and we're gonna do some beam profile testing just to see uh, which one has a better beam profile. Now, if, I think this is the most comparable as far as throwers go, in my opinion. When it comes down to throwers, I think this is gonna be the most comparable as far as size, everything. Both are running optics, bezels on here. So, we're gonna try both of them on turbo. We're not dealing with that uh, low, medium, high, or nothing like that. So let's start with the Sofern first. We're gonna hit that first tree. So that's the Sofern on high. Not bad, not bad. I'll put the specs on the on the video when I edit it, um, but this is pushing a, a little bit more power, so you definitely get a lot more uh, usable spill with the Sofern opposed to the Ace Beam L17. So let's do the Ace Beam L17 now. Ace Beam L17 on high, Sofern IF22A on high. So I don't know if it really picks up that well on the camera, but in person, the Sofern lights up the whole entire tree. Compared to the L17 where it only lights up like half of it. So I'll show you right now. Let me make sure you can see that on the footage. So, okay. The L17 is on that tree. I'm moving it up and down, obviously. You can see it on the house. <clears throat> and then if I move it up, you'll see it better, obviously. So that's on high. And I'm gonna stop moving it so you can see. So I have it at the very top of that tree. It only lights up half that tree. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit it with the Sofern at the same time on high so you can see the difference. So Sofern's right here. See the difference? Sulfur, Ace Beam. Okay, so you can definitely clearly see the difference between the beam profiles. So on that house, Sulfur on the left, Ace Beam on the right. So you get a lot more usable spill with the Sofern. It's definitely got a much larger hot spot. So if I light that up right there in that corner, Ace Beam. So hitting the door, it lights up pretty much the porch in that door and nothing else. Now with the Sofern, it lights up a lot more. So I don't know, I mean, to me, I like them both. I like the, the tight spot of the Ace Beam L17, but I also love the throw and the spill of the Sofer. I mean, it just lights up so much more. You get so much more usable spill. Now let's hit these both on turbo. So Ace Beam L17 on turbo right there. That's a powerful little light, man. <laughs> For being an 18650, that is a powerful light. That's on turbo. That house is probably a good 80, 90 feet away, even 100 feet away possibly from where I'm standing. That tree is about 400 feet away from where I'm standing. Hits it no problem. The tree to the right of it is about 480 feet away from where I'm standing. And it easily hits that no problem. I mean, it's like no problem whatsoever. Now let's try the Sofern. I have 22A on turbo. Alright, that is on high, turbo, <laughs> it just not only throws the light, but it literally lights up that whole entire tree, Ace Beam on turbo, it lights up a good portion of that tree, so for on turbo, lights up the whole entire tree, and it is making it to the tree in the back. 480 feet away from where I'm standing. Now you can definitely see where the beam profile starts to lose itself to the ace beam a little bit more because on that tree in the back, I got it on turbo. Now I'm gonna hit it with the ace beam on turbo. 
See the difference? So for an on turbo, Ace Beam on turbo. Definitely got some throw though. I mean, it lights up all the way across the street easily. It lights up that whole entire tree in the corner. I don't know if you can see that on camera. So that whole entire tree. Bam! Blast it with tons of light. <laughs> Sulfur turbo. Ace beam turbo. Wow. Man, that is impressive. Ace beam L17 hits the furthest, furthest trees all the way in the back. I mean, even the trees all the way back there. Those trees, I don't even know how far those are. Those are very far from where I'm standing, and it is hitting those trees back there. So fern. Let's see if it hits that all the way back there. It's hitting it. I mean, it's not as direct as the ace beam. You can see when the ace beam takes over. Wow. You can definitely tell when the ace beam is uh, taking over because the sulfur definitely has some throw on it. It's not no slouch, but huge difference when the ace beam hits it. It's like, wow, you see it. Like if there's something in that tree all the way over there, I can clearly see it. Unlike the sulfur where you can see the whole tree, but it's not as direct as the ace beam is. Wow. So I don't know. I mean, that's both the lights right there. So right is Ace Beam L17, Sofer and IF22A on the left. Ace Beam, Sofer. Sofer, Ace Beam. I don't know. I mean, it's really going to come down to what your preferences are because ultimately these lights are both throwers so it's really going to come down to do you prefer the wider more spill area thrower as, as the Sofern IF22A gives you or do you prefer the further more punchy distance that the L17 Ace Beam gives you it, it's a tough one it is a tough one now these reflectors I know it's kind of dark but these reflectors you definitely have a much deeper reflector on the L17 opposed to the Sofer IF22A. So, I mean, and then you got to remember too, the Sofer is 697 meters. The L17 is 800 meters. So there's definitely a huge discrepancy between the two, a hundred meter difference. Um, so it doesn't surprise me that the L17 throws to that tree all the way out there much better. And it's starting to snow right now, of course. <laughs> but I mean, I love both of these lights, I really do. I can honestly say I love both of these lights. Um, it's going to really come down to what your preferences are and what do you prefer the most, you know. For me, it's one of those things where I honestly, I like both of them a lot. They're both throwers and they both have their purposes. Now, the Sofern is going to definitely have more of a usable spill opposed to the Ace Beam L17, but the Ace Beam is going to have way more punch to it, so if you need something far in the distance, it's going to be the Ace Beam, not the Sofern. So, well, that's all I got for you guys tonight. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.